I just wanted to show you that we 100% believe in buck aprons. No one should ever have goats and have just a willy-nilly breeding season. Some people do it and we don't. We have way too many nannies. And even though we're in Tennessee, in Middle Tennessee, Southern Middle Tennessee, we still 100% believe in buck aprons. Get a lot of questions on what's this orange thing and that used to be, I'm going to show you what it used to look like. What color it used to look like. Churro um, definitely puts his through the ringer. We have 26, 28, 28 girls total between both herds. And he has 12 girls just by himself. So... A lot of people say, oh, that's way too many for one buck. But he gets the job done because everybody gets to be a mama. So we'll leave this on him until October, November. This so way we have spring babies. We don't have a heated barn. We do have heat lamps. Um, and we do have a barn for them to go in if they do have babies um, in the middle of winter. But I try to not let that happen. Um, a lot of these girls are all veterans of being mamas. There's Elf and Daisy. She just had one. Um, and then these two girls, they'll be kidding um, in the springtime. This will be their first babies. Um, their mom was really good. She always gives me solid black babies, either one with blue eyes and one with brown eyes. She's always been a real good mama. And there's Nikki. Nikki got her name because her mama's name is Penny. And we just call her Nikki, short for nickel. She's a great little doe. Nikki! She's really sweet. And I cannot wait to have babies by her. These are our big fearless dog that stays up all night, sleeps all day. That's what she does. And she does a really good job. Now let me show you what the buck apron looks like. Nice, clean, fresh water. That's how it always should be. I'm going to have livestock. I seen someone post the other day about having putting goldfish actually in it. And I thought, well, that's kind of a cool idea. But we have Every critter on earth here. What are you doing, Paisley? Ma'am, that's not a bed. Y'all done knocked the mineral down. They're so sweet. Bless it. This is what the apron should look like. What are you doing, Marlin? Hey, baby. What are you doing, baby? See how orange that is? We're in the shade, and it's pretty bright. Hi, baby. Come here. I know you're mad at me. It's okay, I don't have feed. But that's what it's supposed to look like. Bright orange. And he is only four months old, and this is a small, and it fits him pretty well. It does what I need it to do, and that's just protect from having any winter babies at the moment. We're not set up for these guys to be in here with the smaller ones. Um, so as soon as we get their fencing done, that's where they'll go. Hey, Penny. What are you doing, Mama? Hey, boo-boo. Penny. Marvin. It's hot, ain't it, babies? A little span of four cross, little doling. Can't wait for her to have babies next year. And we have a Karen. 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 Please don't ignore me. Karen. Karen. 
That's her. She's our big body door. Super sweet. Great, great. With my little girl. That's all I ever want. Sweet goats to be gentle enough around my kid. And that should be everybody's goal when they have goats and children in the same vicinity. And that's the rest of the herd down there. Because they don't care what I'm doing up here. A little dapple doe. And that's my little dapple nanny. I got two of them. Alright.